Hello, my name is Jonathan Morrell, and these are the steps I took to create my scale model of falling water. First, since I cannot find the actual dimensions of falling water, I built a LEGO guide model to guide me through the measurements. After that, I decided which scale I was going to use, which was the same scale as the LEGO model because it worked out so perfectly. Then, I mapped out all the dimensions of the LEGO model, simplified the 13 rectangular boxes because making the model with every architectural detail would be overly tedious. To make it easier to visualize, I numbered all of the blocks and put them in a spreadsheet, as shown here. This spreadsheet includes all dimensions of the house with both scales, which as I said before were the same. Upon completion, I gathered all of the materials needed to create the house. After that, I had my dad help me with cutting the blocks to the needed size since I didn't know how to cut the wood with his complicated tools. Additionally, being inexperienced, I could have gotten injured. After my father helped me with cutting the blocks to the needed size, I glued them all together to resemble falling water. When I finished the model's foundation, I painted the house to its original colors. Then I finally finished with shaping the terrain with clay that was on the wood of which my father cut and glued. To add further detail, my mom and I painted the river and added rocks and trees. The end result, as you may see, ended up looking something like this.